hello and welcome back happy tuesday my name is amber stewart i'm the owner of the stew project and that is where we maximize people's living potential by simply taking emphasis on wellness and more specifically we help people who deal with chronic stress anxiety or depression learn how to break free from the mental prison that keeps them trapped and held back so that they can finally improve their health increase their wealth and live the life of their dreams. And so one of the topics that I wanted to discuss for today's Life Coach PSA would be um, the three things you start to tap into um, when you are aligned to your power source. And so um, this topic came to mind just simply because like a lot of times people have a hard time eating healthy and exercising, um, meditating, resting, um, doing all the self-care things necessary to maintain your energy, your strength, and to ensure a happy, healthy, long life, God willing. So, um, because I know, um, when you have a hard time doing those things, like it's easy for things to fall asleep, but I don't feel like it, I don't do it. Um, you have to think that that is something much more bigger as to why you're doing this. Like, yeah, you're doing it to eat healthy. Yeah, you're doing it to stay fit. Yeah, you're doing it to like ease yourself and to make your life better. But ultimately it's so you can stay connected to your power source because when you are doing everything so you can be well, when you know that you are in a right mental space, things are going good for you, um, you're comfortable, you feel safe, you feel protected, you feel loved. Um, whenever you feel like everything is going right and you start getting these weird feelings, like these anxieties and certain things, um, that is really just, um, your spiritual self or your intuition speaking to you. And it's kind of hard to discern the difference between what is like your normal anxiety and what is your spiritual anxiety if you never manage either of it. So you can be missing life lessons and missing blessings that are coming your way because you are so focused on either running from the feelings or ignoring the feelings that you are not able to step into who you really want to be. Okay. So, um, all right. So moving right along the three things. So when you learn to balance your life mentally, physically, spiritually, when you learn all about that balance and you're able to tap into your power source, um, tap into your intuition. So when you pray, um, or when you make your requests or when you're trying to manifest, you can get those downloads and be able to have a two-way street instead of a one-way street. You know, does that make sense? So you can have feedback. So you can get the feedback from the universe or your, your creator, whatever you want. Um, okay, so the first thing that you tap into when you're aligned to your power source is a new identity. Simply because you are no longer focused on limiting beliefs, what others say about you, um, past trauma, past failures. You are always aligned to your good and you are wanting what's best for you to your highest good. And so even if you don't know what the future is, you know that whatever lies ahead will be that and so you're always accepting and in a loving state and in an open and receptive state um and so if that's what you currently are then congrats but if not then that would be the first thing that you gain a new identity so now the second thing that you now gain will be new expectations and so where you were once thinking small and hoping for just a little bit, you'll start thinking larger 
and grander and you will stop playing it safe and you will stop doubting yourself or doubting your wishes you'll get more excited um simply because you expect more because you know that your creator is an abundant giver and so you're like oh well i have abundance waiting for me and so you expect abundance and that's the second thing that you get when you tap into your power source the third thing that you tap into when you align with your power source would be new possibilities and so instead of thinking of solutions coming from a fearful state you'll be thinking of solutions coming from a place of love from a place of abundance and a place of growth and a place for your highest good um, i know two three years old two year two to three years younger amber would not be making big bold moves that i'm doing now but it's all because of my alignment to my creator to my power source and the faith to back it up because it's like hey i'm supported i'm always supported it's like i've always been supported so let me just put more trust in who's trying to support me um so yeah your possibilities will change as long as you're as well as your expectations as well as a new identity and that is why it is so important to get the bases down it's like okay so i know how to stay in line with my power source easy peasy i know what to do with the day-to-day -day things i know how to follow through i know how to keep the faith and stay aligned and you are more because you've become um disciplined enough to stick to things and to put forth effort and to be consistent in the simple things such as staying aligned and doing the exercise and the stress management and the nutrition and so now when it comes to doing big projects um you're more well equipped to do that so i hope this helps this is why doing the simple things um, for wellness is just the tip of the iceberg but once you get that down it's where the fun really begins and i hope this helps if you need help my coaching program is open for enrollment and there will be info in the comments and I hope to speak to you soon.